What the hell's happened here? Why is my arm glowing red? Was that because of the room thing? Hang on, let's, let's drop this down. Just this, what the hell? I can't see... I can't see crap. Let's just take a cat potion right here. Don't know whether this is going to be overkill. Enhanced cat. Is that it? Can't remember what cat looks like now. Um, enhanced full moon. It's where's it gone? Oh, there it is. Let's take that. This is awesome. The best haunted house so far. Well, let's see. Uh, let's see what goes on here. Now we can see. Oh, let's just dodge a bit. This is just a general rape. She's healing. Can't have any of that healing that's going on. Twitch going mad. It says I've got 90 viewers, but no one's showing up in the in my chat channel. Um, sorry, my chat client. This. Welcome, folks, if you are indeed there, or I don't know whether Twitch is just going bananas tonight. Search for Iris. I think we found Iris. I should have Spectre Oil on for this stuff, shouldn't I? Let's do this properly. Quit your healing, woman. I add her, by the way. Uh, no, that didn't work very well. It's flooring me, but not doing any damage. Which is, I think, intentional. Quit your wicked claws. Can I get it trapped against there? What's... What's causing it to heal up like that? Do I even need to use Erden on here? Can I hit those paintings? And not set fire to them, because that would be awesome. Can I set fire to her? Mm, not very. Destroy the painting? The glowing painting. Which is a glowing painting? Is it a oh, I see. That thing, right. Ah, I see! That made a difference. What about this bleeding one? Hmm. So now what? Now which one is it that? It's not that. Which is the one that's... Oh, I see, I see. Thanks, chat. That helps. That does help a bunch. I should have, I should have known that for my Call of Cthulhu day, shouldn't I? That should have been blatantly obvious. No, you're not doing this again. There we go. And the rape and the painting. Now we're going to get some story out of this. See what's going on. Use Ard on the paintings? I never thought of using Ard, Papsty. I haven't what had hell was that? a whole lot of success with Ard in this game. Oh god, is the house burning down? This probably isn't a good time to still be here. Oh, it's just the paintings burning. That's alright then. That's alright. That's still locked. Bed chamber. Iris was supposed to be here. She is. There's a body there. Can you see it? Let's uh, raspberries. Oh, hang on. Before I check that body, what is this? Portrait of Iris and Olga. Lovely couple. Oh, that is nice. There's, there's a sad tale attached to this. I'm convinced of it. I'm basically playing Layers of Fear now. What's Layers of Fears? Never heard of that. Oh my god. Gotta be her. Damn it. She's been around a while. You wish to see her? Here she is. Thank you, dog. 
A man should frame his wishes carefully. It forestalls disappointment. This some sick joke. Why didn't you tell me she was dead right away? I thought it was obvious, actually. You didn't ask. <laughs> <sighs> and why hasn't anyone buried her? We can't. As for the caretaker, the one you cut down, while still alive, she ordered him to stay away from her for all time. Why? Why? The deeper I get into this, the more I gotta wonder. Why are you even helping me? We were summoned to serve Iris von Everick. Our mistress died, but that did not free us from her service. Got it. You want to leave this place, leave these bodies. <laughs> Surprised? No, not at all. Hmm. How did she die? Laser of fear. It was a horror game centered around a painting. Was it anything? It won't be anything like... Um, oh, what was that? Um, oh, Dorian Gray? Nothing like that? How did she die? Don't see any wounds. Evidence of a fight. Her heart burst. Meaning what? A heart attack? No. No, it simply burst. We're talking heartbreak. Find that hard to believe. Yet that's precisely what happened. One day Iris locked the front door, uh. lay down here and died. From grief, from loneliness. Wait, she's wearing the rose in her hair, look. Or some sort of flower. Can you see it? That That's it, isn't it? That looks like, they look like roses to me. They look like the roses in the portrait. Her we can do this. restless, angry, attacks intruders. Know why? Lady Von Everick has endured much hardship. She's unaccustomed to guests and not fond of strange folk. Strange? You're calling she me strange? Hear us. I'm wondering if these animals are actually real. They're not violet? Actually, I've never seen a violet rose. No, you're right though, they're not violet. Just paint them violet. I like your thinking, True Barlow. I like that idea. He would never know. Seems I gotta speak to Iris's ghost. It's no easy task to contact the mistress. Rage and bitterness fill her. Got my ways. To make contact with Iris, I gotta bury her body. But that caretaker's macabre little cemetery won't do. Too much blood, too much fear. She spent much time in the front garden. Go on, plant her. Maybe there. <laughs> Wait. Take this key. It opens the front door. Good dog. <laughs> this is weird, this quest. Violet roses exist? I've never seen that colour. There's no blue and no black roses. No, that's, that's true. Violet is like a... It's like a... Is it light purple or dark purple? I can never remember. I know it's purplish. Finding spirit. A, a fitting spot to bury Iris. Right. So I came in. I just want to see if there's anything else. My potion's worn off now. I think I'd been through here, hadn't I? Yes, I think so. I don't need to do... Oh, it's, it's teleporting me downstairs. So I'm assuming that's the end of the upstairs bit. I'll just have a quick run up and check. Can't go across there. Weird noises going on here. Got to say, it's a good haunted house. I'll give it that. I could just vault over the top here, couldn't I? Did I get everything out of this room that I wanted to? What about in here? That's locked and still won't open. Did I finish this place? What about this one? <laughs> Those guns and roses. Do you ever use Igni to turn on the light sources around you? Yes, occasionally. Sometimes do it by accident. Um, I used to like light them, loads of them up on purpose. Like that. I used to do it when I used to go into... Not loot. Like, I thought it's... No. Yes, I can. I can ignite it, but it's... I don't want the pipe out the wardrobe. I'll take all good Venevrik back his pipe. And I say, look, all good, I got this pipe, your pipe, from your bedchamber. It was next to your wife's body. And he look at me and says, I don't smoke a pipe. And it'd be like that song that the Dubliners sang. 
was it the seven drunken knights? It was just that pipe upon the chair where my old pipe should be. I can't light that damn thing. I wasn't doing that because you asked me to. <laughs> I can't get the pixel perfect positioning for it. I knew there'd be somewhere else to check. Water. Okay. This is the oh, this is the art room. This is where we paint the roses purple. You see, the plan is coming together. Every artist needs a good stock of beer in their studio. It appears. Kiss her? I don't think so. I don't think I examined the body, though. Did I? No, it won't let me. Was there one other place? This door here. Nope, can't do it. Okay, let's leave. Let's go and find a spot to bury her. And get this done. Can't remember the way out now. Have you kept the robe I got from the wedding? No. No, I'll have sold that. Not intentionally, it'll have just been in my armor list when I was having a clear out at the blacksmith's. Okay, so we've got several spots to choose. Oh. Hmm. She liked to sit here, but this is not a good place for a grave. And you think if I'm digging through that load Too of stony path, house. you can I think again. Searching. I spent more than my fair share of time digging holes. <laughs> I know what surfaces not Iris to look at. Adored flowers. But she would never want to destroy them. Mm. She's a bit fussy. Right. This looks like... Else. Hang on, there's some manure up here. I'll bury her in the muck midden. Oh, hang on. It's going to be by the painting, isn't it? This is going to be perfect. This place seems suitable. Uh, could yes. you use the Roman blood and wine? Uh, shame. Did Iris von Everick have any last requests? See how she wanted her remains disposed of? She feared death. Worried none would see to her burial or say a kind word in parting. We'll burn it. Guess I'll be the one to do that. We'll stuff her into a cannon and fire her remains out over the walls. Perfect. Uh, Iris von Everick was a talented painter. I don't know that. Let's start with... Let's start... See, why was she heartbroken? Was it just because Olgird left? Or was she heartbroken because he did something and, like, had an affair? So it might not be good to mention his name. I don't know. Let's try that one. I didn't know Iris von Everek, so I can't say much about her. Fate had it a stranger now lays her remains in the grave. At times, fate muddles our path, and life turns toilsome, hard to bear. Yet all deserve respite and peace in death. That wasn't a bad speech. Placed us. Oh, I, I, I picked all this stuff up, didn't I? Placed the ornamental hairbrush on the grave. I can't be sure this brush was yours. Okay, I won't place but it on the grave. If you liked pretty trinkets, you might not mind this one lying at your side. Ah. Uh, it's not letting me go back and place the other things. So I don't know if she was a talented. She couldn't have painted the portrait of the pair of them. Someone else had to have painted that. I don't know about the hairbrush. Hmm. You know that if you read the notes from the Borsodi auction house, you placed the sketch pad because you loved painting? Oh well. You two. Got any last words for your mistress? We don't partake in human rituals. And yet you're stood here. Trusting that what you've done is in keeping with your customs. Uh, well, let's try to summon her then. <laughs> The remains are interred. Let's summon her. Hmm, I thought I could maybe dump all three down. Tormented spirit, I've laid your bones to rest. Forget your wrath, forget your grief. Show yourself. What's that? What's that in the house that's sparkling? That, that looks like something I haven't picked up. Did you see that? Well, it kind of worked.
Forgive me for tearing you from your realm. I need to ask you. She talking? Uh. Her paint was in the auction house. Oh, that was a sketchbook. I thought I picked that up. I thought it gave me the option to lay the sketchbook on the grave because I thought I'd picked it up. <clears throat> Should I follow you? All right. Okay, this is getting weird. Oh no, this reminds me of a quest from Oblivion where I accidentally got sucked into this painter's picture. What is this place? Way too low a level and had to fight a load of trolls to get the, the means of getting back out. Yeah, I remember that the quest. The Painted World. The work of Iris von Everek. How do you two get in here? We exist in both worlds at once. Oh, you remember the uh, Oblivion quest too? <laughs> Did you not use the paint thinner in that Oblivion quest? Yeah, but I don't think I don't think I had enough of it. Um, I can't remember. I remember going in. I remember just wandering into this guy's house. I maybe picked the lock to get into his study. I don't know. Because that's the sort of thing I did. And then I clicked on the painting just because I could. Nothing said enter painting. I just put the cursor over it. It changed image. I clicked on it and got sucked right in. Where the hell is this? And then I was way too low a level and I had far too few fire arrows and stuff to kill the trolls with. And I remember being stuck there for a long time. I had to use every cheating method I could find to get out of there, like hiding between rocks that the trolls couldn't come through and shooting them with one thing at a time until they eventually died. It was tough. Strange place. One born of Iris von Everek's dreams. It existed only in her mind while she lived. In death it gained substance. Pretty fantastic tale. Hard as hell to believe. Yet you'd best believe it, and be on your guard. The painted world is rife with danger. Where'd Iris go? Alright, this is lovely and all, but where's Iris? You awoke her, but for a moment. If you wish to speak to her, you must tear her from her slumber completely. Sure, but how? You're a tracker, right? Saw you examining the tracks outside. Yeah, so? This is a world built of memories blurred and wilting. Moments our mistress wishes to forget, but cannot. Hmm. You need to find them, restore them, summon the fears that torment Iris, and destroy them. Easy to say. This is very strange. Okay. So let's get stuck in then. Uh, there's clearly something in here. Spectres of Olgid and his wife. But why aren't they moving? They're painted, of course. This is a memory. Oh. But it's incomplete. Blurred. You must peer closely and restore it. Is this going to give me some options? Where I have to use my own judgment on how I restore things. Hmm. Just get a neuralizer from Men in Black and erase their memories. Well, let's see what we've got. Let's take a look. What, what's that? A painter's palette. Okay. Palette. And we've got a teapot. Pieces of tableware for an afternoon tea or breakfast. We need... Oh, what's that over there as well? The Spirit from the Step. The Spirit from the Step. I was going to start well singing worn. the Spirit in the Sky then. Fit right in. Uh, Might man yet learn his neck to bend. How behold how that noble race doth year by year its birthright rend, its promised lands fast lay to waste. Hearts grown cold, brothers, brothers spurn. The rich go fat while poor grow thin. Some hoard bread. Others can but yearn, then rise en masse to slay their kin. 
I better read this because no doubt there'll be something I need to remember at some point. Taste ye now, my missive fruits. Feed on them, O oh heartless brutes. This world you've bit with cruel tip fangs. Your dark crime's venom now through it seeps. Above, God's wrath in wild clouds hangs. A cleansing storm soon to unleash. It's almost Shakespearean, this. Man, a riddle stuck in sleep. A grub enwrapped in spittle beneath the tumult of raging skies. Waits and grows little by little. Till at last, a bright ray it spies. Spreads new wings and away it flies. May this thought with man endure. May we ever in heart recall this merry creature winged and pure and how it started so strange so small whoever seeks from flesh a cure the skies above doth plead and call may in this soul our tale hope stir okay that was complete bollocks to me uh, but I, i'm not really a poetic sort of person what can i do with this she needs a paintbrush in her hand look iris was painting the manor yeah Needs a paintbrush. I can give her a... Right, I can interact with this, can I? Oh, well, the coffee pot, the teapot wants to be on there. Probably not right. Get out of it. Of course it is. Look, he's reading a book. That's obvious. The spirit from Perfect the stage. Okay. I can put the pallet. She's not holding a pallet, so... I guess that has Perfect to go in there. Match. Everyone puts a teapot on the table. Hmm. Or a dog and a cat. Even better. When the rain comes, the dog will warm my feet and the cat will play with a ball of yarn by the fire. What do you think? Is he listening? Are you even listening? <laughs> Apologies, dear. I had my mind on my book. Is it that Terribly absorbing? Hmm? Yes, uh, terribly. Know what? Let's go inside. Why? It's lovely out here. The birds singing, the bees buzzing. Blissful, really. Sorry, dear. I feel unwell. I'll go in. You stay a while longer. Hmm, we're going to get some story out of this, I think, now. What the hell? Something to fight? Wasps? I think I need a uh, art. Oh, well, I burnt them, so that's okay. Hey, cat. Have I got the new free game from Epic yet? What's the new free game from Epic? After Shani, Iris is the other wifey. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, girl, draw your sword against a swarm of bees. I'm sure that will help. It might now, now that I've got it charged up with... The, and it's the silver sword he's pulled out as well. I suppose these are like... Mystical piece. The shovel. The shovel would have been a good option. Swatting them away, right? That would have worked. Here's the bees. Let's see what, let's see what Art can do. I think, I think Igni was actually better. What is that? What a memory. I, what have I burned? Hmm. It's Gollum. Last no, no, a nightmare. A fear embodied, which sooner or later you will have to confront. Curious. This is going to have some weird twist, isn't it? Uh, the last day of June was the free game from Epic. Okay. Iris seems to be very caring. I don't know enough about her so far. Something's obviously really upset her. Uh, let's chase these bees away. Igni cures everything, I find. But first you don't succeed, just set fire to it again. I feel like I should be looking down there. Whoa, it's a spectre. 
Actually, that's not that type of Spectre, is it? But I think Spectre Oil would probably be a good idea at this point. Let's whack a bit on. I don't use it often enough. Hang on. Ooh, I've got slowdown going on. That's good. <laughs> well, it looked fancy. It didn't do a huge amount of damage, but it did look pretty fancy. Where the hell are we going? The hell was that? Oh, hang on. Yeah, having a bit of trouble with the bees here today. Tattered decorations for a special occasion. There's some flowers. Ooh, you still want to play this game again? So many awesome memories just from Hearts of Stone alone. The whole, the, just the whole Witcher experience Another is memory. just too good to pass up on. I'm already thinking how I'm going to play it again. I have another bouquet of flowers. Thank you very much. And a glass. Wine cup, just like the one Olgir's holding. Uh, what's that? A wedding veil. Wedding oh veil. dear, this is going to be sad. Okay, so this must be a toast. This looks like a toast. Put that one Perfect in there. match. Your health, my dear wife. Hmm. And yours, well, they're already married then. Husband. In my land, custom calls that newlyweds be greeted with bread and salt. But we're alone for now. I need none but you. Oh, if only this moment could last forever. I shall see what I can do. But come in and see our home. Gladly, but I know this sounds silly. Yet the house has sat empty for so long and I'm... Afraid of spiders. I know, I know. I swept them all up and tossed them in the garden. I just met them, yes. My knight, you've seen to everything. <laughs> There's one. <laughs> Geralt's not messing with the spiders. So again, these are uh, her fears, Iris's fears. Yeah, big spider. Oh, damn it all. Ow. Oh, get it trapped against the fence. There's three over here. Oh, I'll get them all trapped. For this whirling death. Go for it. Let's build some stamina back. Hang on, 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 a bit ahead of myself. I hate these damn things. Right. <laughs> that was a little bit close. You would also be afraid of spiders the size of a car. Yeah, that that's that's fair enough. Bread and salt Russia? It's bread and salt um Same figure. What's the what's the what's the place name of the place in for the Game of Thrones? I can't remember the name of the kingdom, the land, Westeros. That's it. It's Westeros. So we've been along here. I got rudely interrupted. Uh, let's just make sure. Get some more bees. Oh, God. That was a big critical hit I got pulled up from there. Bash the monsters. Where's his mate at? Missed. 2,452. Critical hit damage. That was quite sweet. Right, what have I missed around here? Anything? Wait, that was that statue. Remember the one we saw broken? I think that was that statue that we saw broken in the uh, the real garden. Okay, well it's telling me to go in the house next, so let's go in the house. 
Just my instinct for these things tells me to explore everything. Did I not kill that first one? I thought it went down. Nice. Making short work of those things. That's locked. Let's just go in the house, I think. Thinking about camel spiders now. Australia's a pretty wild land. You wouldn't want to live there yourself. There's some scary things in Australia. It's a beautiful place, though. Okay, what we're looking for. That's a way out, I think. Another dream of the past. Here but we go. This one's incomplete too. There's a lot of stuff down here. Just a little different than the painting. Look at all that food. Castel Ravello. A Toussaint wine. Expensive. Let's take a look at the painting as well. So there's... There's like five people sat around the table at that end, and another chair pulled out. But no place setting. Suckling pig. Don't recognize any of the others. Do I have to set this up so it looks... Let's light the candles. It's because we can. Seen this hairbrush. It was in bad shape in the real world. What hairbrush are we looking at there? These were lit in the painting, but that's not all. A lavish feast, trying to impress the guests. Okay. I didn't realize that there's bodies still here until I came down this end. Silver thread, pearls, it all must have cost a fortune. Okay, I'm, am I missing something here? Something gone? Oh. Maybe I don't want all the candles lit. Let's take another look at this painting. The ones at this end aren't lit. Let's turn those off. Uh, anything else? Maybe I haven't picked everything up yet. Damn, it's dark in here. Let's put a torch on. Hmm. Sometimes you think I don't pay attention at all. So we've got the two ends of candlesticks down near them that are lit up. We've got those sitting around the thing. Oh, the fire's lit. Is the fire lit? Let's go light the fire. There we go. Sometimes it's the little details. The stuff that is not centred. My darling, is everything alright? You seem pale, out of sorts. Everything's fine, really. But why don't you tell me how you fare? I'm ever so happy to see you. Except, why didn't Grandmama and Grandpapa come? It's a long, rugged journey. Muddy. They're dead. They still refuse to meet me. Is that oh, it? I see. I see. And what's this? We brought some of Iris's things. Her favorite brush, her cherished doll, ah, uh, and uh, this. So it was a favorite brush? Banknotes. We paid off your debts, bought them out, to avoid bringing shame to the family. Ah, so now he's owned by her parents. So nice of Mama and Papa to remember me. Oh, kid. What was that? Now you see his true nature? I warned you before the Oh, wedding. his parents. A ruffian and a boar who keeps the company of bandits. Are you not afraid to live under one roof with that rabble? Maybe she is. Okay. Get specked. There we go. Not you again. Who was that? 
That was uh, that was pretty cool story. You feel bad for Iris? That was Iris's parents. Olgier burned the debt note. 